I was there. At the siege, I am one of the few Sons of Horus left after the Legion broke. I had my own war band for a while, but when we met up with this Black Legion, I joined up. But I continue to be my own master. The first captain will not control me, for I control the warp. And Korox, the chain splitter, has summoned you, Lyric. Huh? Tori wants to talk to me? Yes, that's what summon means. Are you gonna keep monologuing or? I'm coming! As much as I am loath to use your kind, I cannot let the alerts have advantage over me, and since my previous advisor has broken, you will be his replacement, or paint. I will do whatever you ask of me, Lord. Use me as you wish. All I need you to do is look where I cannot, and stay out of my way, especially when the males start to bite, till you look like you may survive longer than you from a normal. I'll last as long as you like, Lord. You need but ask. Hmm. Or am I just kill you now? A small portion of my forces has gone missing, and my compass has been broken without my permission. You mean the ones that left the yesterday? They're in a battle as we speak. What? Yeah, I felt them leave with Sierra, the uh, Night Lord Sorcerer. I thought it was odd you would send Sierra to do something. Even past your stance on sorcerers. It's kind of a known weirdo. And you know where they are? Yeah, I can tell, Corp. No, no sorcery! Yes, my lord. So, if you remember my World Eater Terminator video, I... It's got 10 views. Oh, well, I referenced a video that I hadn't made by then, but was just about to. That was in March. It is now August. Anyways, I've always felt like the current Chaos Terminators look good, but they don't look like veterans of the Long War. They look like they're from the Black Legion. And I have a mixed Chaos Army, so for the other Legions, it can look a bit off. So let's combine the normal Chaos Terminators and Cataphracti Terminators together. Also a sorcerer, because I like sorcerers. So for this guy, I want Cataphracti legs and a Chaos body. So on the body, I cut the leg off his little cape, trying to preserve both ends. Then cut off the waist and put them together. And there's a big chunk of plastic in the way. This won't be seen. So no need to be careful when attacking it for its crotch block and crimes. And yeah. Yeah, no, that's not gonna fit like that. So I just cut his ball off. There we go. Looks nice. But he's got kind of a pose going. I got an idea. I grabbed some cardboard and cut it up into random shapes and hot glued them into the base. And using some PVA, I glued some tiny rocks on there. Yeah. Tactical box. So then I just gave him an axe and a sword. I thought it would be cool to choose from either a force axe and power sword or force sword and power axe. Also, cataphracti shoulder pads work on Indominus arms. And I was about to prime him there and then. I believe he was on the priming stick next to the apothecary, but. I decided to give him a cape, be a bit more sorcery, but to do that, I needed to rip his arms off to wrap it around him. He's so nice and warm. And I still wasn't happy with him. The cape didn't really add much. If anything, it kind of took away from any back details he had. Hmm. Let's add a bit more to the cape. Then I took my knife and made it look like fur by poking it and going up and then repeat a million times. That's better, but no, it still doesn't look like a sorcerer. Mm, yeah, sword has to go. But then I added a cataphracti lightning claw. Yeah, he's cast some spells for sure. And if I add a bit of green stuff to his fingers, stretch it out and then twist them together. Yeah. This is how I'm gonna do magic from now on. And then I did a similar thing for his axe. So he's like enchanting it. Yeah, I really like this. Wouldn't it be a shame if I were to add a bunch more strings and completely ruin the effect? <laughs> Whatever. I decided to paint him as Black Legion, because he gave me Sons of Horus vibes. Speaking of, I 
I did Dark Angel's green for his base coat instead of Black Templar because I wanted to make it a really dark green to the point it looks black. But before I finish it, I'm going to do all the other stuff first. For the cape, I was going to do Rhinox Hide for the inside and Xandry Dust for the trim, but I decided it would look better reversed. But I still don't know. I think it would have looked good either way. Then for his metal bits, I did Lead Belcher, of course. Similarly predictable, I did Retributor Armor on all the trim, but now I get to do the magic with, fittingly, Warped Lightning. I also did his Lightning Claws and Force Axe as well. Then Skeleton Horde for his skulls and horns. The helmet on his back is a Black Kemplar, by the way. For his face, I did Bugman's Flow. I was going to do some Reikland and Kislov, but I liked him as is. And now that all the other base coats are done, I did, um, like, 4 to 1 contrast medium to Black Templar. I don't know. I tried to make it so thin that you could probably just use Null Oil instead. Especially with that new Null Oil that's more like contrast. Probably could have used it instead if we had it. Now? Mix, 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 mix. Yeah. Then all that was left was some Tesseract Glow on his magic. <laughs> And boom, one less model on the pile of shame. And now, hmm, I can get some Chaos Bikers. Wait, my new Chaos Codex arrived. I sure hope they didn't remove all the war gear options for everyone I've built so far. Oh.